After you take the pretest, you're ready to get started. But first, you need to get your checklist ready to track your progress. And there are two ways you can do this. The first way is to just ask your teacher for a copy of the checklist. As you progress, you can write your scores down on the checklist. There will be various activities in the modules. From time to time, you will do an activity, a score will be shown, and you can write that down. When you have finished all the activities in a module, you can give the checklist to your teacher. The second way is to make a digital copy with Google. Before you can do that, the first thing you need to do is to open your Gmail. Make sure you have the right account. And then click the tab to return to Canvas. And then in Canvas, click the icon for checklist and you will see this document. The first thing you'll notice though is you can't write in this document. This is the teacher's copy. It's view only. So you need to go to the file tab up here, click on that, and then click on make a copy. Then you will see this box. Here you should change the title of your copy, erase the part that says copy of, and put your name in the beginning. That helps your teacher to keep track of the document. Also, if this is the first module that you're doing, it's a good idea to make a folder for this career. So click on the folder box here, click on My Drive. You might already have a folder there of photos or something that you put there before. But down at the bottom, you'll see New Folder. Click on that, and then in the box, you can put the name of the career that you are starting to study. Click the check mark here to create the folder. Click select at the bottom and then click OK which will save the checklist in the folder. Now you have your own copy of your checklist in your Google Drive. At this time it's a good idea to just close the checklist that that you couldn't use before the one that belongs to the teacher. You don't need that one. And now you can put your name in the top. Now you're ready to start studying. And you can put your information here as you go. So use the tabs at the top to return to Canvas. On the link to Vessel page at the bottom, you'll see the button you can push, which will bring you to the vessel module. You can go through the modules at your own pace and it has various activities. As you saw before, many of these activities will have scores for you. It will show you the score, but you need to record the score in your checklist. So, to do that, go back to your Gmail. Up in the top right, click the menu bar for Google Apps, and go down and click the symbol for Drive and then you will see your folders again. 
open the folder that you created for this particular career and then you have the checklist open that and you can put the scores in for the lessons that you do check the box on the left write the date and write in the score. As you study, you can share your Google Drive folder and the checklist with your teacher to show your progress. You can use the tabs to return to the module lessons or you can use the link to vessel uh, page in Canvas and click on the blue button which will bring you back here. Now, when you finish a module, you need to click Next down here at the bottom right, which will take you to the assessment that you do at the end of the module. Take the assessment, and the score is recorded in Canvas. It's automatic, so you don't need to put this score on your checklist. Also, after the last module, there's a post-test. This is also on Canvas. You don't need to put that on the checklist either. And that's what you need to do to use your checklist.